Well, with this hot weather, it's no surprise beaches are packed. Stony Creek Metro Park was still busy around 8 o'clock last night when two guys went in the water, but one didn't come out. It's the first drowning of the year in Macomb County. Mara McDonald is live in Washington Township. Mara, do we know what happened out there? Steve, we do, and I want to show you guys two things first. Number one, take a look over there. There's a clearly marked no swimming sign. And why is there a clearly marked no swimming sign? Take a look at the water. You can see the heavy vegetation in there. The Macomb County Sheriff's Department is telling us two friends decided to jump in anyway last night around 8 o'clock, and both of them struggled to stay afloat. Police and fire were on the scene in minutes after being called out, but it was too late. Police say two friends, one from Warren, the other from Sterling Heights, hopped in the lake. Both of them were struggling because of all the vegetation in the water. One of them managed to make it to shore with the help of a nearby boater. The other, 20-year-old man, Raven Elia, went under, and the Sheriff's Department and Park Police think he was under for about 15 minutes when they pulled him out, did CPR, and got him to the hospital but he was pronounced dead overnight. Back here live, this section of the park is called Winter Cove, and it is primarily a picnic and barbecue area, although you will occasionally see people launch canoes or kayaks here. It is definitely not a swimming area, and the Sheriff's Department tells us that neither of these young men who went in had on any sort of life jackets or anything like that. We're live at Stony Creek Metro Park tonight. I'm Mara McDonald, Local 4. Yeah, the signs are there for a reason. Thank you, Mara.